Although it weighs only 2% of the body, it alone uses 25% of all the energy that your body requires to run per day. That's 500 calories out of a total of 2,000 calories just to keep your brain working. So, the human brain is larger than it should be, it uses much more energy than it should, so it's special. And this is where the story started to bother me. In biology, we look for rules that apply to all animals and to life in general. So why should the rules of evolution apply to everybody else but not to us? Maybe the problem was with the basic assumption that all brains are made in the same way. Maybe two brains of a similar size can actually be made of very different numbers of neurons. Maybe a very large brain does not necessarily have more neurons than a more modest-sized brain. Maybe the human brain actually has the most neurons of any brain, regardless of its size, especially in the cerebral cortex. So this, to me, became the important question to answer. How many neurons does the human brain have, and how does that compare to other animals? Now, you may have heard or read somewhere that we have 100 billion neurons. So 10 years ago, I asked my colleagues if they knew where this number came from. 